Hey guys, so we're going to do the rest of the cards that were spoiled today. Harness the Storm, 2 in a red, Enchantment, rare, whenever you cast a instant or sorcery spell from your hand, you may cast target card with the same name as that spell from your graveyard. This is very interesting for the modern deck. What modern deck is it called? Is it Storm? I think it's Storm. Obviously, Harness the Storm seems like a good title for the name. Might see some play in that deck. And modern. Epiphany at the Down Yard. X in a blue. Instant. I like that fact that it's an instant. Reveal the top X plus one cards of your library and separate them into two piles. An opponent chooses one of these piles. Put that pile into your hand and the other into your graveyard. So for one, you get no cards. You just get one card in your graveyard. For two, you get a card and a card in your graveyard, which is pretty good in my opinion. That's probably going to be ca costed two or casted at two a lot. Next, we have an uncommon, which feels more rare than the last two. Rise from the tides. Five in the blue. Sorcery. Put a 2-2 two -two black zombie creature token into the battlefield for each instant in sorcery card into your graveyard. So happy to see this. This is the set's Rune Chandler's Pike. Rune Chandler's Pike was so fun back in the day. Uh, counting your instants and your sorceries and then hitting your opponent for damage. This is pretty much the same deal. I do feel like this card in limited is very, very good, but it, it might see standard play. Six is a lot, but looks like we're going to see more control decks, to be honest. And this will be on the top end of a control deck and be relatively playable depending on how many can trips you can play.